हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू द वर्चुअल क्लास ऑफ स्टैंडर्ड कॉस्टिंग इन प्रीवियस टू सेशंस आई हैव डिस्कस्ड वैरायंसेस रिलेटेड टू वेरिएबल ओवरहेड्स एंड टुडे इन दिस सेशन आई वुड लाइक टू डिस्कस वन मोर क्वेश्चन रिलेटेड टू वेरिएबल ओवरहेड्स वैरायंसेस सो बिफोर डिस्कशन of the solution of the problem let us try to understand the question first calculate variable overhead cost variance variable overhead rate or expenses variance variable overhead efficiency variance we have information related to this question in a tabular format particular budgeted data and actual data output for budgeted data 2000 units whereas for actual data it's a 2200 units budgeted variable overheads are given as rupees of 15000 while actual overheads incurred by the company is rupees 16000 budgeted hours 3000 and actual hours Three thousand two hundred and seventy. At this point, I would like to inform you that very first time, these budgeted hours are given in a total format. In earlier two questions, it was given per unit, but here, these three thousand hours are given as a budgeted time for the manufacturing of two thousand units. So. be careful at the time of analysis of the data let us move to the solution of the problem for the purpose of solution as you all know that we are in need of four important calculations and after that we can apply all these calculations in our formula first we need to calculate budgeted rate we can calculate our budgeted rate using two different methods first budgeted rate per unit formula for the calculation of budgeted rate per unit budgeted variable overheads divided by budgeted output rupees of 15000 given by the examiner as a budgeted variable overheads and we have 2000 units of budgeted output so budgeted rate per unit is rupees 7.5 same way we can calculate budgeted rate per hour for the calculation of budgeted rate per hour formula remains same only the denominator is going to change formula budgeted variable overheads divided by budgeted hours 15000 rupees given as budgeted variable overheads and 3000 hours ready made given by the examiner in the table so 15000 rupees divided by 3000 hours budgeted rate per hour is rupees 5 now we have budgeted rate per unit and per hour let us calculate actual rate per hour formula for the calculation of actual rate per hour actual variable overheads divided by actual hours the examiner has given all this information to us in a ready made form actual variable overheads are rupees 16000 while actual hours spent to complete the task is 3270 so actual rate per hour is 4.8929636 for the 100% perfect calculation i have taken numbers of digits if you consider only two digits it may be possible that there is some variation in your answer so to avoid 
any kind of problem it is advisable to consider as maximum as possible number of digits let us move to fourth item it is important for our solution calculation of standard or budgeted hours for actual output information is given for budgeted hours with a different units of output but our actual output is different so we need to revise our budget or standard when budgeted output is 2000 units at that time budgeted hours were 3000 earlier it was given for one unit of output but here it is given for total budgeted output that is 2000 units for the manufacturing of 2000 units we are in need of 3000 hours and we have actually manufactured 2200 units so how much of time required in hours simply it is a cross multiplication and with the help of cross multiplication you can find out your answer 3000 hours multiplied by 2200 units divided by 2000 units so the result is 3300 hours for the calculation of variable overhead variances we are in need of four items and we have completed all four items one by one let us prepare the database and this database will be useful to us in order to calculate all three variances budgeted rate rupees 7.5 per unit rupees 5 per hour we have completed a calculation of budgeted rate using two different methods actual rate 4.8929636 per hour budgeted hours 3300 just before a moment we have completed a calculation of budgeted hours i repeat we need not to use budgeted hours given in the question we need to calculate budgeted hours for actual output using cross multiplication and that we have completed just before a few moment actual hours 3270 this information is ready made given to us in our question with the help of this database we need to calculate all three variances the first variance is variable overhead cost variance total standard variable overhead minus total actual variable overhead let us calculate variable overhead cost variance based on hours budgeted hours multiplied by budgeted rate minus into bracket actual hours into actual rate bh into br minus ah into ar let us visit our database budgeted rate is given budgeted hours are given actual rate is given and actual hours are given we have completed calculation for all required items let us insert all items one by one in our calculations 3300 hours multiplied by rupees 5 minus actual variable overhead 16000 if you want to calculate using formula it is okay but if you don't want to calculate these item using formula it is not necessary to calculate because total actual variable overheads are given by the examiner in a ready made form to us simply pick up the figure from the question and insert in the formula so as you will get your answer 16500 is amount of your budgeted overheads or standard variable overheads while actual cost incurred is rupees 16000 so the difference is rupees 500 and it is referred to as a favorable because we have paid rupees 500 less than that of 
द बजेटेड एक्सपेंडिचर वैन वी आर पेइंग लेस एक्सपेंडिचर इट इज पॉजिटिव साइड फॉर द कंपनी एंड दैट इज वाई इट इज अ फेवरेबल नाउ मूव टू द सेकेंड मैथड ऑफ कैलक्युलेशन ऑफ वेरिएबल ओवर हेड कॉस्ट वेरायंस बेसिक फॉर्म्यूला रिमेन सेम बट दिस टाइम वी विल कैलक्युलेट बेस्ड ऑन द फिगर ऑफ आउटपुट एक्चुअल आउटपुट इन टू ब्रेकेट बजेटेड रेट माइनस एक्चुअल वेरिएबल ओवर हेड्स एक्चुअल आउटपुट टू थाउजेंड टू हंड्रेड यूनिट्स मल्टीप्लाइड बाय रुपीज सेवन पॉइंट फाइव पर यूनिट वी हैव कंप्लीटेड कैलक्युलेशन ऑफ बजेटेड रेट पर यूनिट फॉर दिस कैलक्युलेशन ओनली एक्सेप्ट दिस कैलक्युलेशन वी आर नॉट इन नीड ऑफ बजेटेड रेट पर यूनिट एनी वेर इन अवर कैलक्युलेशन लेटस सॉल्व द प्रॉब्लम टू थाउजेंड टू हंड्रेड मल्टीप्लाइड बाई सेवन पॉइंट फाइव इक्वल्स टू सिक्सटीन थाउजेंड फाइव हंड्रेड माइनस एक्चुअल ओवर हेड इंकर्ड सिक्सटीन थाउजेंड सेम रिजल्ट रुपीज ऑफ फाइव हंड्रेड फेवरेबल इट इज एडवाइजेबल टू कैलक्युलेट वेरिएबल ओवर हेड कॉस्ट वेरायंस यूजिंग बोथ द मैथड्स इन ऑर्डर टू वेरीफाई योर कैलक्युलेशन इफ इट इज ऑन अ राइट ट्रैक यू विल गेट सेम आंसर इन बोथ द मैथड्स लेट अस मूव टू सेकेंड मैथड सेकेंड वेरायंस वेरिएबल ओवर हेड रेट और एक्सपेंस वेरायंस फॉर्म्यूला एक्चुअलर्स इन टू ब्रेकेट बजेटेड रेट माइनस एक्चुअल रेट refer the database we have actual rs 3270 actual rate 4.8929636 and budgeted rate rupees 5 per hour let us insert the values in the formula 3270 as actual rs budgeted rate per hour rupees 5 and actual rate is 4.8929636 here we have decided to pay rupees 5 per hour but at the time of actual payment we have paid rupees 4.8929636 per hour it means we have paid less per hour to the concerned person when we are paying less it is affected to our profit positively because if expenditure is less total cost is also less and when the total cost is less it affects to profit positively so the difference is rupees 350 favorable if you consider only two digits then there may be some difference in your answer so it is advisable to consider digits in full or as many as maximum as possible digits in order to solve the problem let us move to third and last variable overhead efficiency variance budgeted rate into bracket budgeted hours minus actual again refer the database that we have prepared we have information of all the variables that we are using in the formula budgeted rate budgeted hours and actual hours insert the values in the formula budgeted rate rupees of 5 budgeted hours 3300 as per our calculation and information related to actual hours are given in ready made form 3270 so 3300 minus 3270 is equal to 30 multiplied by 5 so the difference is rupees 150 and this difference is a favorable that we need to interpret we have decided to complete the task using 3300 hours but we have completed our we have finished our task using 3270 hours only here we have taken less hours than that of budgeted hours it means the rate of efficiency is high when the efficiency is high 
the situation is a favorable to the company so in this way we can calculate and interpret all three variances related to variable overheads now verify all three variable overhead variances using relationships variable overhead cost variance rupees 500 favorable variable overhead rate variance is rupees 350 favorable and efficiency variance is rupees 150 favorable if your all calculations are correct it is a matching with each other automatically i hope everybody is clear thank you keep watching next sessions god bless you keep learning keep growing